What's going on guys? How y'all doing today? Southern guy here and today is Monday, which we all your Wednesday. Tonight is Monday Night Raw. Monday Night Raw takes place in Las Vegas. They're gonna be on the strip tonight for Monday Night Raw tonight. And uh them happy exclusive WWE Raw Review. Raw review exclusively right here on the channel. I have the raw review tonight immediately following. Monday Night Raw, what goes on as we're on the road to Fast Lead. This uh, SmackDown had their last pay per view event last night. WWE Elimination Chamber, which I didn't get the review. So, this is what it is. I'm putting my, my review today because last night I was so tired out. Godly, guys. I had to go, I went to a, uh, went to my mom's Reboots yesterday, around 3 o'clock, uh, got there at 2.30 something, but didn't leave till, till, uh, 3 something, or, four, I mean, uh, didn't leave till, like, about, her thing was at, from 3 to 5, I thought for about, I think around 5 something, I got home in time to watch Elimination Chamber at 7, I watched Elimination Chamber, and pretty much after that, I was tired out. I didn't have no energy to do it. It was a step. It's a remembrance, more of a for my mother. As y'all don't know, she passed on last Thursday. Last Thursday, it's a very, it was a very sad day. I got to see all my cousins and my grandma and uh, my brother. My hat, my brother, Colin. It was a very, it was a very, it was a very. Very, very emotional day for me yesterday. So I didn't get to do. I did watch a little bit of Chamber. So y'all just keep me in your prayers and throughout your prayers. But there you know, even though the memories for yesterday. Um, guys, I'm gonna do the Monday Night Raw review tonight. As promised, there won't be no Lack Nation tonight. I hope, hopefully, I'll have rest so I'll be able to do. I went to Body Girl. Body Girl stood here. I went to Body Girl on Thursday. I think I went all, no, I went all, I didn't go Friday, I went Saturday, there was two parades and one, so I went to parade, went to the Pharaohs and the Mystic Society Parade, and then I went to the Cod Explorers for Saturday night. Now this Thursday is the Women's Parade, the order, uh, the first Women's Parade of the year, Order of Polka Dots, and then on Friday it's the Guys Parade again, the Order of Inca, which I will be going to, which I will be going to the parades. So, last night we had the last uh, last day, the last pay-per-view for SmackDown Live, which was the Elimination Chamber. They won't have no more pay-per-views before WrestleMania. So, they had their last little pay-per-view, last last, pay, last big pay-per-view last night, the Chamber, uh, Elimination Chamber. And what went down, we saw Becky Lynch versus Becky James, which Becky Lynch won over Mickey James last night. Uh, she beating her, pinned her, one, two, three. And then after the match, Becky Lynch jumped, got jumped by Mickey James. Now, I'm hearing they're setting up a match between Becky Lynch, Mickey James, and Alexa Bliss for WrestleMania. Now, that's a rumor match going around right now that WrestleMania is going to be like, it's going to be like the Raw type match. Like, like the Raw brand. You're going to have the Women's Championship all the line. You're going to have Alexa Bliss defending against Becky Lynch. And Mickey James for SmackDown Live. Also, another rumor match going around since last night. Barry Corbin put D. Debros through the pod of the Liberty Chamber match last night. Now I'm hearing there's a rumor match going on for them for WrestleMania. Barry Corbin versus D. Uh, D. Debros for the Intercontinental Championship for WrestleMania. Also, another match that's been really, been really been talked about: Nikki Bella and John Cena teaming up against Maurice and The Miz. That's been really hyped up last night when Maurice bumped in. Well, Nikki Bella bumped into Maurice last night at the Elimination Chamber, and that's being set up for WrestleMania. That John Cena lost the WWE Champion World Championship. So now we're gonna see, also we're gonna see Brady Orton versus Bray Wyatt. What's the think about that? Bray Wyatt won the Elimination Chamber match and will face his former friend and a Riot member, Riot family member, Randy Orton. He will face his friend Randy Orton 
fam Riot family member inside at WrestleMania. Wow, what do you think about that? So much guys go with all rumor matches being taking place. But we're going to talk about Elimination Chamber. WWE Elimination Chamber 2017 results and reactions for last night. Uh, they were, they were, it was Sunday, February 12th, 2017. The, the match took place. The pyro hit off and we seen, uh, singles match Becky Lynch versus, uh, Big, Becky Lynch versus Becky James. In this match, in this match, Becky Lynch won last night. Well, we saw Becky Lynch, so I'm just going to say that. Y'all already know what happened. Becky Lynch won last night. Becky Lynch countered with a roll-up of her own. She scores the three count. Three count. Becky Lynch beats Becky James. Becky Lynch heads for the ramp quickly after the match, celebrating while Mickey James stands on the turbuckle. She stares and drags Becky Lynch down. James Ellsworth and Carmella watch from a sky, from a sky box. They asked their option on the show. That's what this says. What she says. A brief, a brief commercial. So Paula Cruz hits the, hits the arena, makes his way down. Reacts to Kalisto, makes his way out. He immediately jumped from behind by Dolph Ziggler, who throws Kalisto into the LD, L, LDG, uh, whatever I can't say it. L. ED board screen behind the entire rest. Cruz uh, took Dolph Ziggler out. Two on one handicap match. Apollo Cruz went out by himself. Was, uh, very, as you know, Kalisto got jumped. In this match, it is where Kalisto heads back to the ring. Kalisto heads back to the ring. Ziggler away. Ziggler makes his way to the back. Uh, we seen um springboard and a stint time back of the back of Ziggler's head. Kalisto scores an impressive series of kick strikes and kicks. Cruz makes his makes the tag and hits the Apollo uh, the power bomb for the three count. Apollo Cruz, winners. Apollo Cruz and Kalisto defeated Dolph Ziggler. We're back in the arena for uh, the chamber, hyping the chamber match. Keith Slater and Rhino were the first two men out for the tag team match with a nice little pop for the crowd. Bejago scored the tag team set a uh, set kickoff match, and the entire way we're wearing ridiculous marine outfits, which I don't know what about that. American Alpha versus the Usos versus Sitch of Keith Slater Rhino in this match. Brizango have been eliminated, got eliminated first. Next was the Bond Villains to get eliminated. And then Keith Slater and Rhino got eliminated. The Usos got eliminated. And winner and steel, WWE SmackDown Live Tag Team Champions, the, the American Alpha. Now here the American Alpha are going to be defended, defending the tag team titles against the Usos at WrestleMania. Nikki Bella is the first warrior out for the next. She goes on about this nice little pop for the fans and her, her way to the ring. Natalia is out next. It get, she gains up on her way. Nikki Bella versus Natalia in this match. In this match was a double count out. Nobody won. Carmella was in the skybox. She says both women have major issues that they ha are out of control. That's where Patriots Carbella. Bray Wyatt cuts a promo but uh Randy before Randy Orton tells him to us to run. Randy Orton versus Luke Harper in this match. Randy Orton defeated in this match. Randy Orton defeated Luke Harper. Close lines, then the RKO put Pins Harper against the three count. Radio Art defeats Luke Carver last night at Elimination Chamber. Following the Randy Orton match proposed, WrestleMania logo, Luke Carver recovers of the back. The chamber is shown as AJ Styles is backstage warming up. There you go. Here's Dickie Bella. 
Naomi versus Alexa Bliss for the Women's SmackDown Women's Championship. In this match, do and do, winner a do SmackDown Women's Champion Naomi, which I knew who was going to win that. I predicted they all be to walk out the Women's Champion. Next match is the Elimination Chamber match: John Cena versus AJ Styles, which is a debate of it. Versus Bray Wyatt versus Dean Ambrose versus The Biz versus Barry Corbin. In this match, we've seen Styles tease a collapse, but Cena launched him into the backdrop. We've seen him back and forth. Fireman's carry, neck breaker, combo. Cena ducks, clothesline, a couple of shoulder tackles, but belly's better suplex. Cena called five like a shuffle, but the count was on. The Ambrose can. Ambrose for the, uh, Ambrose for the clothesline. Styles attacks from behind. Suplex style, Styles with the, the, does the same to Ambrose. Bray Wyatt's up. Big Sid way out. Well, Cena is crashing down the outside. The pod is met with Dean Ambrose slamming face first. Bring it, bring uh, leaps on. In this match, we're seeing also Corbin was uh, Corbin waits for Miz. In the ring, was rolled up by behind Ambrose with the three cap. Barry Corbin gets eliminated with first elimination. He was first to get eliminated. Dean Ambrose was next to be eliminated. The Miz was eliminated, and it came down to John Cena. John Cena got eliminated. John Cena got eliminated, but both men were able to get uh, slow to get up for the three cap. Styles tries to hit the phenomenal forearm, but Bray Wyatt clutches him and hits the sister Abigail for the three count. Winner and new WWE champion Bray Wyatt, who will now face Randy Orton at WrestleMania. Bray Wyatt is given the title. He is immediately begins launching, uh, laughing and rolling around with the title. In hand, this is the first championship win. Bray Wyatt points at the WrestleMania logo while holding the title high before laughing a bit. And the, the show ends with the fireflies in the audience. Orton staring on for the top of the entryway. Wyatt drops down at the last, holding the title. That is your official WWE Elimination Chamber. Elimination Chamber review and results and reactions for tonight from last night's WWE Elimination Chamber pay per view. I hope y'all enjoy it. Sorry I'm putting it up for today, put it up so late. And like I said, I was tired and didn't get the chance to put it up last night from all the stuff I had going on. But I hope y'all enjoy it. Please give it a thumbs up, like, subscribe, and favorite. Hope y'all enjoy it. Hope y'all have a great rest of your day. I'll see y'all guys right back here for Monday Night Raw review tonight. Immediately following Monday Night Raw at the 10 o'clock hour. Have a great one, guys.